Alrighty, and here we have some more 2v2 action. I have not played except one match since the last time I posted a PvP video, so we shall see how it goes. I have some dumb ideas in mind that I'm eager to share, and of course, if you like what you see, like the video so I know to make more. Ooh, Rhino Reinforcement with Mustang Crawler Opener, but Speed Specialist. I'm gonna go with Rhino Reinforcement. So my plan, I just want to go full Crawler. I like Crawlers. I really like Crawlers. I don't like Mustangs. So we're just gonna go Crawler, Mustang. And my opponent opened with Crawler and Tanks. Supply Spec and Quick Supply. We're just gonna open it with Replicate. And of course, you gotta hit him with the Prediction. Oh, demoralize the enemy. Mm, maybe pull these back a little bit so they don't get blown up by a missile. <laughs> Should I do this? Rapid resupply for more crawlers? It's a bad idea, but I'm doing it because it's funny. Oh, my opponent kind of really misplaced his crawlers here. They're going to get into combat first with my crawlers. Mine got replicate. They're just going to eat through them all, get these tanks. These will help clean up the tanks. I think I got it. And my... Huh, double missile early. Kind of weird. You don't really get experience off that. Strange. I'm going to look over here. Yeah. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. expected it to go. Now, tanks are really good against crawlers. Because they do pretty uh, decent splash. Wow, despite wasting a hundred bucks, this guy lost. That's not good for his economy. Although I can't really speak about economy because I did waste $100 to even replicate round one. So, uh, yeah. Mm, yeah, that should be fine. Yeah, it should be good. We'll just grab another unit. Boink. I'm still gonna win on this side. And these guys got there in time to kill this. I had an impact drill, I think I could actually kill this Vulcan with just my little dudes. Guarantee you right now, if I get the 200% sentry missile, I'm just double shooting Vulcan. Oh wait, he's gonna level. No. <laughs> okay, I may have done this to myself. Oh, 
Okay, so you can't actually kill a Vulcan with crawlers using um, impact drill with uh, subterranean blitz, but I don't have enough money for that. I think I do this. And then we just photon coding him. Then I get mobile beacon. Oh, that's not good. Get another one. I should have put this right over here, maybe. Hmm, strange. He didn't put anything back here. Yet. Operative already yet. Yeah, I should have maybe angled this one downwards. Yeah, I should have angled it downwards. Oh well. Mistakes were made. Hmm, I'm about to lose this tower because of that too. That's rough. I'm gonna lose because of that fight. Slight misplay. I should have just made the beacon stop right here. Oh well. Ah, Marina still lives. <laughs> Smoke bomb. Through <laughs> <Or> my crawlers. <laughs> Seems good to me. And just in case. Alright, I'm going to grab some more water while this runs. Now the problem is, I can't shoot up. Oh wait, never mind. Totally can't shoot up. That was the power, right? I wasn't paying attention. No, that just appears to be an actual mothership, or er, overlord.
I'm kind of confident that we can close this game out, so I'm just going to keep taking the loans. Terrible idea, but who's going to stop me? No one can stop me. I'm all about bad ideas. You know why? Bad ideas are fun. And you know what this guy's not gonna expect? Uh, if I angle it like this, it should perfectly hit there. I'm such a nice teammate. Such a nice guy. He does have another Vulcan, and they are using Incendiary Bomb. Oh, they did come back for him. Unfortunate. Okay, my fight's basically one over here. How's this guy doing over here? All right, walking past just like I thought. Okay, that's one. This tower's dead. He's walking through the front line over here. Yeah. And these guys are not going to kill this right now. There's like a little guy <laughs> trying his hardest, man. Alrighty. There's something fun about crawler spam. How much insight do you get for that kind of thing anyway? There we go. This, this is the new group, and I'll continue back when the round shows. All right, what do we got? Arclight and Stormcaller start with Rhino again. I do like the Rhino opener. Fun. Or should we try Elite Specialist, even though it's not that good? There's Surely there's something we can do with Elite Specialist that's fancy, right? Let's find out. I've heard Elite Specialist is not good. But let's find out how, how good it is. I'm at an ELO rating where it doesn't really matter. So, we shall see. Now I'm going up against the guy who's double my power. He is Giant Specialist. They are both Giant Specialist. Hmm. I could push up all the way onto them. It's better to be back here so you can guard your flanks, but... I kind of feel like... This is like the right move, something like this. And then you have these guys back here as a distraction. And then I just pass the turn. Unfortunately, crawlers do beat fangs one-on-one. -on -one. And hopefully... Oh, I've made a mistake. I have made a big mistake. I should put these a tiny bit further back. That's fine. 
this this video is all about learning you know just trying to trying to see what's new and uh my poor decision making skills just the typical thing Not terrible of a loss on my part. Oh, I killed them? I mean, of course I did. I'm so good at the game. Yep. I think these guys back here is going to be good. No, I don't feel like dealing with nonsense on my left side. I think I get a Rhino. Or a Phoenix. Mustang. Hey, what's my teammate doing? Taking a gamer loan? Nope, he's taking mass recruitment. He's going up against Mustang Crawler with a bunch of tanks. That's in his favor. That is a Did unlock Mustangs though. Um, this one has armor on it. This one does not. shouldn't I really shouldn't I think it's funny I take this and we get armor piercing phoenixes well one guy got the memo and then next turn I think I get um either aerial or just range He's about to take massive damage here. In case you didn't know. Take additional damage.
I think I might just take uh, uh, I might take aerial specialization because if he goes armor on that thing, I'm not gonna be able to kill it. And it did level just now. Nope, oh, doesn't matter. Yeah, we're kind of just sucking down money, aren't we? Yeah, I don't care. I never knew this was 100, by the way. I always thought it was 200 like the others. Hmm. Yeah, he does have armor. It doesn't matter. Because this makes it so it doesn't matter. Depending on what I want. Probably want a rhino. But I never listen to myself. Uh, 40 meters is this far. I wonder if he realizes the shield um, doesn't protect his overlord. But it does mean my guys don't shoot up. There we go. And now he's paralyzed with the tower and he can't use his little ability. It's still a lot of health to go through though. But it does not matter. Plop. Oh, there's a game. I couldn't swap my uh, arc lights in time. My arc lights are still built for a survival and not for PvP. Oops, because I don't have armor on my arc lights. All right, what do we got? Aerial specialist, giant specialist, or quick supply, or elite. Elite's bad. I kind of want to. I kind of really want to. Let's do it. I want to see what makes elite work. That's a problem. That's a problem and a half. That's a problem and a quarter. I think elite and then hacker opener is actually not bad. I might do that. Let me just take the L in the first round. I think that's what we do. What's he do first? Grab his Mustangs. So he goes Marksman first, up front behind his tanks and stuff. Okay. And then we put a hacker like here and then a shield around it. Not my plan.
Uh, it did get far enough forward. Those mine? No, those are his. As I say, I don't think I had crawlers. Well, that's a pretty good in 2v2, aren't they? If my brain is wired to survival where wasp are a terrible unit in survival. Or maybe they are good. And I'm wrong. I think I get some arc lights next. What's he got over here? Doesn't look like this guy's up done much. Has he just been like buffing his tanks or? What's he holding his money for? Hmm. Oh, is it just wasp on the flank, maybe? I have no idea. I mean, this guy's just upgrading straight through. I mean, upgrading straight through is just really good. I mean, crawlers have 900 health. They're pretty tanky little things. What I need to get is replicate on my crawlers, I think. If I steal his, it's his tech, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's his tech. actually really good but do I have enough uh, money for it not really I think I don't take it actually and I think I just take one of these for now yeah, I forgot to put back on my um, my good stuff. We'll grade the right one first. He could really hose me by putting something like right here. Because it would divert my forces like this. Make it easy to surround. Level 4 crawlers. Scary. He's got wasp upgraded. Just kind of general stuff. Like the second person I've seen use sludges. And they ran out of time. There we go. Burned him to death over here. Now hopefully arc light turns left. Beautiful. Double beautiful, did it? Hit that. And now, that's my sniper.
This is really good. Oh, do I have enough money for what I want to do? Six, three, nine, ten. Yeah. Um. I think we just distance here. And then we just boom town, whatever comes first. Now, if this gets to the you before you get to me, that's no bueno for you, sir. Because um, hackers are level two do 3,000 damage a second. And these take a while to get through uh, shields, so they're pretty good against hackers. Now this is a problem. I need to start feeding it little stuff. I didn't realize he's gonna do that. I wish I'd have moved this down here, but my placement was slightly off. Aha! There we go. It's got no range. Although, the downside is my Vulcans are shooting it constantly. That's not good. I need to put a Vulcan back here. I think the answer is just more Vulcan. But uh, we might die here. We died. Oh, well, what can you do? We got them again. Rematch. All right, what do we got? Arclight Sledgehammer Marksman Start is actually pretty good. I like it. So, uh, oh my goodness, this poor man. I think I just opened up a double marksman. And then we grab some crawlers. And then we just put some stuff here. This way they can come down here and shoot the flank. And I think it's okay. What's my doing supplies? Mustang crawler opening versus 200 supplies. Speed specialist. Now, did I go against this guy last time or did I go against this guy? I don't remember. Because it very much matters. Because if it's the same guy, he'll do like the same thing. Roughly. Wait a while. got some phoenixes okay and he did grab mustangs and an extra arc light he has another 100 bucks he can spend right because you start with three arc lights oh he unlocked mustangs duh and i think that's okay because these should hopefully approach and kill these. Yeah, I think it went well on my side. There we go. Went nice and easy on my side. And then... He wins on this side because these guys can't shoot up. Although he does have anti-aircraft ammo.
Well, it's amazing how much different setups are for PvP because PvP doesn't last that long. It's like what, ten rounds max usually. I'm thinking about getting this, or just the money. I like both. This is good like long term because you can get level two units immediately. But it's bad short term because it uses your money. I think I grab it though. And then I think I just dropped three arc lights right away. Let's see what's going on over here. My companion is flanking with crawlers on either side. They do have arc lights though, which will take care of the crawlers. And then a regular setup back here. Okay. And then my guy is setting up a missile to kill my tanks, which is unfortunate. Should have considered that maybe. I think it's okay though. Because these arc lights should hopefully tackle the problem. Yeah, I think the problem is solved. And my teammates side of the field. I think I beat this. Mm, maybe. I don't know. Stormflowers I might not be. Those are kind of a problem. Because I can't outrange them yet. They're 180. And they do have a uh, range enhancement. I had to be like level 8 with elite and range enhancement to beat that. But I think the Stormflowers do win the round here. Maybe if I can kill these fangs. No, I don't think I win. These are going to win. RNG's on my side. I just focus on my units and I don't get anything else. I like what I have. I should be in, like anticipating what the opponent's gonna do to counter me and then try to counter the counter. Uh, but that's like 40 chess and I don't care. Man likes his crawlers. They're not flanking us again, but they are waiting out the clock. He did get extra health on his units. And he got some more balls. Man, these guys do shoot up. Oh. And he got energy absorption. That does not do much against me, I don't think. Oh, wow. He outsmarted the crap out of me. I guess the extra balls do help. Yeah, the balls actually won. Hmm. 
wasn't expecting that. Any more, I want to say little stuff, but arc lights are really good against what I have. So are balls and arc lights, along with other stuff, just good? I don't know. I need something against balls. I see the setup on a few different people. Is this like normal for PvP? Okay, so how do I counter ball? Hackers. Should I get some stuff with shields out, maybe? I'm not exactly sure what to do. Maybe I just need to start using shield generators, but his guys are, like, way better at shield generators than mine. Maybe I just do something like this. So he upgraded his balls. This guy is going... Bang. You can shoot up and extra distant arc light. Okay. Outrange him. I do not outrange Stormcaller though. And he upgraded his Phoenix. Why wouldn't you get armor enhancement? It just prevents the kill, doesn't it? Yeah, do you do like 11 damage to this guy? Alright, let's see how this goes. Alright, stole one ball. Alright, stole the stuff, nice. can kill these. I do have balls. But this hacker goes over here, I think I win. Good boy, hacker. Good boy. Oh, we're stealing their good stuff, too. Oh, I almost stole it. There we go. I like that. And I need... I want to say these. By the time this moves down, just go clock and clock him. Like a clock him, sock him, little robot. And what's my teammate doing? I'm gonna leave this on the enemy side of the field over here while I go get water. Right, I'm back. Yeah, this guy could get pretty scary, but he can't outrange me, so it's not too bad. I'm kind of curious what this guy can do. I mean, honestly, Wasp 
might be the answer because I don't have any Mustangs right now. So if he just goes like a lot of Wasp, I'm good. And there goes Big Boy Rhino. Uh, Rhino, I need you to. Yeah, thank you, honey. Now, the nice thing is, these guys might heal, but my guy does uh, ignores heal. Oh, just like I said, Wasp. Yeah, I can't shoot up. However, I do have shields, like full health shields. There we go. Did my teammate win? Nice. Yeah, that, that shield is so nice. And it only goes up every level. There we go. Ooh. I need to do something like this. Yep. Yeah, good. What's my uh, teammate doing? Ah. The Oppo also went to Hacker. Hacker Mans. Maybe I should have just nuked this round because I thought I was going to win and then just cleaned up this side of the field right here. And they did go melting point with energy absorption. I mean, I don't have anything that's got a lot of health. So it's like, it's not that great. And just go range enhancement, I think. Or maybe diffraction as well. Wow, they actually pushed through all this, okay. I am actually shocked. Well, I'm actually thankful for his uh, energy absorption now. It's very useful on my side of the field. Yeah, it's very useful. Thanks, enemy. All right, revenge match complete. I think that's all for this video. I had to do some editing and uh, hope you enjoyed.